even in my own uh, in a personal life, um, uh, as I've been observing how the the development of video communication, video technology, is impacting uh, my own professional as as well as personal life. I mean, today we uh, take for granted many things and we do many things, you know, which I, I mean, um, and while doing us, we don't think much because it, we take it for granted. But but just you think back about 15 years back, when even making a call, international call itself was so difficult. You have to think all the time how much money you are going to spend for that call. Today, if yeah. you make a video call, you hardly think. It's just there. I mean, today I am here in, you know, sitting in, in Trinidad and uh, say my uh, people, uh, they are sitting in India so far away, but always connected and connected also through video and without any cost. So this is, imagine the, the change. And this, I think, um, um, this is becoming now so all pervasive that it is impacting our business model, our professional work, everything. I mean, everything today, um, whether you talk uh, mobile uh, or your cloud technology and you know, social media, everything is uh, becoming a, a new, uh, uh, done to you know, video, video based. So, um, mm -hmm. I, I, I know as a result, I, mean, I think um, the, the, the network which uh, we are used to work so much is now undergoing a change. The whole, um, uh, the whole uh, um, method of our functioning, our managing our business processes also would undergo a change because today a, a consumer can actually monitor the process of a production of a good or services and, and can actually also provide input at the time of uh, you know processing uh, or say a consumer can actually um, alter the design before even it gets into the uh, manufacturing stage so um, um, so instead of uh, communicating one um, one piece of information from point A to point B um, uh, today um, uh, you know we are uh, basically um, what we'll see that the seamless kind of you know communication video communication from uh, you know one point to another and also the other important thing is that you see um, all kinds of communications all kinds of networks are coexisting today. So today, uh, you really don't have to bother much often that how your one device will communicate with the other device. It's we take it for granted. I mean, uh, if you remember those earlier years when uh, you know we used to bother so much about uh, protocols, okay, you know, uh, to communicate even one message from one place to another, you know. Uh, you, you, you have to you, know, you, you have you have to take care of so much about the protocols and everything. Today we we absolutely you know we don't think even twice. Mm -hmm. you know, that we take it for granted. Everything is communicating everything. And now what will happen that you are um, I mean all things which you are using these are basically all smart things, smart materials. You're Today your wearables are smart wearables, smart shirt, smart uh, goggles, you know, uh, smart watch. The highways which you will be you know, driving your car through the smart highways. It's you know uh, your um, um, the I mean your traffic lights are everything will be you know smart traffic lights and you know. so everything is smart because everything is connected to every other thing with hundreds uh, through hundreds of sensors, you know. So um, basically, um, what we, uh, uh, we are going to see in the coming years that your um, as an entrepreneur uh, or even as a as a consumer or as a stakeholder in a business, 
you are really connected with other stakeholders, other and uh, the other community of consumers with millions of devices in a different way, and all the time you are able to interact, influence the process of uh, production, consumption, design on a, on a real time basis, and that is a real change.